and I'm here at the Ubuntu booth with uh, Not Me Yates. Hi. How are you doing? I'm uh, fine, thanks. Yourself. Can you tell me a little bit about why Ubuntu is at uh, Linux, uh, the VMworld? <laughs> at VMworld, yeah. We do so many shows, we don't know which one's which. Yeah. We're only halfway through this one, too. Uh, the reason is, uh, actually, it's the first uh, non Linux show, really, that we've done as uh, canonical. We've done a lot of work with VMware recently. And with our 704 release that came out in April this year, we were the first operating system to include the para-virtualization that fixes the VMI uh, interface, which basically enabled a uh, virtual machine running at Ubuntu to get almost native performance when running on a VMware environment. So uh, once we'd started that, once we'd got those fixes in, involved, we then started looking at uh, the next phase, the next phase being uh, Moving into virtual appliances, virtual appliances as everybody's kind of seen at this show are really the way of the future. They may not be here yet, but they're certainly going to be here fairly soon. And the way that the architecture of the server is changing, a small, easy to use server platform would be a terrific enhancement for all uh, ISVs. So what we've done is we've reduced the size of the Ubuntu server to less than 100 megabytes. So fewer moving parts, less to worry about, easier to maintain, just just enough, as the name suggests, operating system to actually make the system work to enable an application to use that virtual environment. So that's really why we're here. We, we're telling people that the VADK, the Virtual Appliance Development Kit, contains Ubuntu. If you're an ISV, have a look at it, get a hold of it, and uh, see if you can move your uh, applications to it. And the other thing, of course, is we're Ubuntu, so everybody wants to see these. So pretty much we, we've got, I don't know how many thousand CDs, and they're giving them all away. Great. And where can they go if they want to find out more information about Ubuntu or download a copy? Uh, it's pretty easy. www.ubuntu.com. Uh, everything's on there. The uh, release is on there about the VADK. The code's downloadable. If you can't get to the show and get a CD, you can download it there. And uh, the last plug for that is you'll find that the next release of Ubuntu comes out on the 17th of October. So if you're running a current edition, you'll be able to upgrade to the latest one. Um, and another real good plug for that is we've got a tickless kernel. So we're going to get really good battery life and performance out of laptops. Well, great. Thanks for taking the time to talk to us today. Yeah, no problem.